Welcome to Mercy's Designs. My name is Mercy and I demonstrate stamping up products. Today I'm going to show you how to make this cute little easy card. This is using the brand new celebration set, Friendly Hello. And I also brought in an older set from a year ago, Sweet Strawberries, although it's still current. So um, what I am, the main image I'm using here is this one and this one, and we're also using the sentiment if desired. Otherwise, the alternative would be thank you. Okay, so let's get started. The first thing I want to do is bring in my Stamparatus. So I'm going to temporarily set this aside. And here is my Stamparatus. And what I've had decided to use is the contour um, dies. They're called um, ooh, scalloped contours. Okay, so what I've done is stamped it and then die cut this out and then I pop in the die cut that I'm going to actually use. And this helps with mass production and there are a lot of advantages to it. So shaded spruce is what I'm going to use for my sentiment. And this is going to be slightly tricky because I don't want to get it on the main image, but it's not too bad. Okay, that's inked up. And then what I'm going to use just make sure your doesn't have anything on it, which that one had a slight bit. Then I'm using Tuxedo Black, and I'm just making sure this is really well inked. Now I can do it a second time, but I would prefer to do it in one fell swoop. <laughs> so here is how I'm going to stamp that, and there it is. It's a perfect image every time use the Stamparatus. And if it's not, you can redo it. Okay, so the next step is we're going to be creating a little bit of DSP. So that stands for Designer Series Paper. So I'm going to temporarily put this aside so it can dry. And for this part, I will speed it up because it takes a little bit of time, but you will be able to see exactly what I'm doing and how to replicate it on your own. So um, sit back, enjoy, and these are the colors I will be using as well as these two stamps. Okay, so you can see it was super easy and super quick to just stamp randomly. And if you, even if you make a few mistakes, no one's going to probably notice that. So the next part is I would like to color the bird and the flowers. And for this, I'm going to bring in my blends. So here's, I'm bringing this back in. And here are the colors. I will list them below. But they are the colors of this friendly hello DSP. So sit back and watch a little bit more. Okay, and that is as simple as how it is to color this. So I'm going to quickly go ahead and assemble this card, and you can see the finished product shortly. So I'm going to add a few dimensionals to just pop this up and have it look, it, it just looks better with dimensionals. I think like everything looks better with dimensionals basically. So I love adding them, and if you don't, 
have dimensionals, you definitely are missing out and you should order some through me. <laughs> All right, so um, I'm going to put this centered on this piece and then we're gonna bring in our base. So our base is right here and I'm just gonna quickly add the layers. I see my battery is getting low, so I hope I can finish this without interruptions, but if not, I will restart. All right, so just center this, very simple. I, it's a, just a, like a straightforward card, and of course this isn't filled in, but it doesn't matter because this will cover it. It's actually kind of a cool effect if you wanted to even just stamp there you could do that directly but adding a little more dimension I think is always a good thing okay so for our inside layer I have already gone ahead and stamped it and colored it so um, the stamp that I used is part of the set this one and the sentiment is part of also the set but let's say you were in a position that you decided you needed a thank you you can just quickly add a, you know, one right over top of it. So sometimes you can do that, you know, if you have some pre-made cards and you need something and to change it. So with that hello there, you have a lot of options. This, this side I messed up. <laughs> Don't look at that. That was, but we have two sides of the paper, so that helps us. All right, thank you so much for watching. If you have any stamping needs, email me at mewants3 at gmail.com and I'd be happy to help you place an order with the host code. And the last and final thing here is I will add a few pearls. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please consider doing so. So these are just going to go in the center. I really appreciate you taking a little time out of your day to stamp with me. Thanks again and happy stamping.